One of the things that I love about Terizio is when young musicians come to us and we get to watch their reactions to great instruments. You take a 300-year-old Stradivari and you put it in their hands and instantly they know how special it is. So we took several young players, invited them in, but we didn't tell them what they were going to try. And then we put in their hands the Baron von der Leyen Stradivari of 1705. She's beautiful. <laughs> wow. Wow, that's a beautiful back. I'm shaking a little bit. <laughs> that is unbelievable. Stradivarius. Yes, it is. Very nice. Thank you. I'll take it home. <laughs> Can I try it? All right. something from my home country Please. that may or may not have ever been played on this violin. Introduce it then. <laughs> um, this is a traditional Bulgarian dance called Rachenitsa. great violin. Fantastic instrument. It's a nice surprise to have it. <laughs> it asks you just to give it what it needs to speak itself. Even by playing it a few seconds it gives you goosebumps actually the kind of sound that it has. When I was trying it I was playing a lot of soft stuff because I think a lot of violins can sound great loud quite easily but not losing that sort of filled ...ness and core of the sound when it's incredibly soft. Such a jewel. <laughs> I think this instrument, you know, if it's the right match with a musician, I think it would be priceless. I love it. I'll take it. Yeah, <laughs>